I hit $144,000 that year, all while being a lazy young dropout and not even having to start my own business. By the end of this video, you're gonna find out exactly what it means to be a skill-based contractor, and you're gonna learn about the two booming economies which make this possible so you can do it too. There are now three ways to get to 10K a month. But first, let's talk about the two traditional ways. Option number one is to get a job. You're gonna go and spend four years and a fortune to get a degree, only to end up in a nine to five job, struggling to pay back student loans. Not the best route, but it was a possibility. And Ashley did this first, cause everyone tells you to do it. Your friends, your parents, your teachers, your freaking aunts and uncles, everyone. And man, does it suck. You spend 10% of the time actually learning stuff that matters and the other 90% trying to get random credits. To be honest, I don't even know what that means. Plus the cost is way too high for an education that won't even be relevant in a few years. So even though I dropped out after just one semester, I ended up with $10,000 in debt. After dropping out, I had to get a job and make some money. And I started getting a job as a laborer. I was in construction. I did valet. I was even a gas station attendant. And I was a piece of boy rolling the dough. Literally, it was brutal. But thankfully, I actually ended up getting a desk job, which made me 40,000 that year. And I could have potentially made it to 10K a month if I actually stuck around for the next five to 10 years. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> Option number two is to start your own business. While knowing 90% of businesses fail, this path meant that you embraced all of the risk. You'd pour your heart and soul into a business, spend long hours, spend thousands of dollars hoping that it works. And it has amazing potential only if it works. And what's funny, I tried this also. After dropping out, I started a drop shipping store. I learned how to find products in China. I ran ads with my limited credit card, but unfortunately I wasn't able to make enough money. So I had to cancel my credit cards, which ended up putting me more in debt. Then I started a marketing agency and it was cheaper to start and I did make some money, but I had to wear all of the hats and honestly, it was just too much. I did end up learning some skills though. Now both can work, but both have their fair share of challenges. But me being the lazy, ambitious person that I am, the third option to become a skill-based contractor was the most appealing to me. What does that even mean? Essentially, it's the best of both worlds. You don't need to spend years getting a traditional education or risk everything starting a business from scratch. Instead, you leverage specific high in demand skills that you might already possess or you're able to learn pretty quickly. If you wanna learn fast, just subscribe now and I'm gonna teach you some skills down the road. And with these skills, you act as a contractor within the same businesses that were built by those entrepreneurs who took on all that risk and actually started to win. And when you do that, you start leveraging their growth with your skill to make more and learn faster than all the other 95ers who took the first path. Now, the only way this was possible is because of two booming economies, which are now colliding, which means there's tons of opportunities that could be yours. And I've been in the middle of this boom since 2018 and have sold millions online with the information that I'm just about to share with you. So the first is the creator economy. Forbes said that it's gonna be worth half a trillion dollars by 2027. And three out of four young adults wanna become influencers. 75%, it's an insane stat. Now the second economy is the e-learning industry, which will be worth $325 billion by 2025. And I've personally witnessed this growth ever since the pandemic, when people were forced to get their education and information online, but then realized, hey, this is actually a much cheaper and efficient way of doing it. So let me explain. Let's look at YouTube five to 10 years ago. Logan Paul, Mr. Beast, Nelk, all of these kids, they were just content creators. Today, they're behind some of the largest creator brands in the world. Prime, Feastables, Happy Dad. So the problem that you have is that you look at these content creators as people. They're not people, okay guys? <laughs> They're just an influencer in your mind. You become a consumer of their content. Now here's what I need you to do. I need you to change the perspective from them being your source of entertainment to your source of income. I want you to think about it. Why are these companies out there willing to pay these kids 
thousands and thousands of dollars for a little ad on their YouTube video. It's because they shared the exact same perspective that I just told you. It's not just views for them, right? It's not an entertainment source. It's a source of traffic that drives sales to their business. The same way a TV ad or a billboard did in the past. So for you and your mind, these creators are just like startups. The product is the creator and the business can be anything around the creator. Okay, cool. Hopefully now you're understanding the creator economy. But now, why do you need to learn about the e-learning industry? So going back to the stat, three out of four young adults wanna be influencers. Now there's already thousands and thousands of creators out there. In the past, most of these creators heavily relied on sponsorship money and ad revenue from the platform they're posting content on as their main source of income. But if the supply of creators is so high, and the demand for advertising doesn't catch up, then their income significantly drops. So to battle this, these creators started creating their own products. Now, physical product businesses means you're running an entire business, right? So the same risks that we went over earlier, they involve. And if they went and don't do it right, their whole business flops and all of that effort and all that risk goes down the drain. But a low risk business is to sell a digital product. Now, would you look at that, the timing, right? COVID made everyone go digital. And now more than ever, people are consuming digital products like online courses and joining paid communities. And if you actually start looking, some of your favorite educational creators, you'll most likely see they already have a digital product or they're about to release a digital product this year. The reason you need to become a skill-based contractor is so you can help these creators build a successful business. They don't just look for degrees when hiring anymore, okay? They look for skills. Degrees are like a thing of the past. Trust me, I've been in this space for the last seven years and I have never needed to show my degree because I don't have one. <laughs> so that's why at 21, I was able to get to do this and was able to make 10K a month within the year. Now, imagine you were able to work with Mr. Beast, Logan Paul, or any of these big creators in the early days and caught the wave of their growth. And if you did, your income would drastically go up. The same way if you cut the wave of Tesla back in the day, right? That's the way I need you to start thinking. Luckily, if three out of four adults wanna be influencers, then great, it'll be pretty easy to find a wave. So now if you're like, well, Hodge, how the heck do you know all of this? And it's because I've been in this space since 2018. My company has sold over $100 million in digital products for creators. You're literally getting the juice from the source. <laughs> We are the people behind some of the biggest brands out there, which is also why I've had the pleasure to speak on multiple stages, teaching this exact same thing to people and how we've been able to be successful in this space. So don't take what I tell you lightly. This year is gonna be filled with tons of opportunities. If you want me to help you find this opportunity for you, all you have to do is just hit the subscribe button. I'm gonna be putting on more videos, giving you guys more value. All right, let's go, peace.